Public institutions represent a major investment for any country, and the same applies to the Lagos State Public Service. Continuous training and retraining of its workforce has enabled the state government to deliver on its policies and programs. Here's another set of trainings held the past week. Whatever you put into this two-day program, we go to... It is said that training is the option to function effectively in the given task. Considering its importance, the Lagos State government invests in regular training of its workforce. Exchange ideas, share your views. Account and procurement officers drawn from various ministries participate in the training designed by the state government to sharpen their skills in procurement and to keep costs controlled in the face of daunting economic challenges. While declaring the training open, the Commissioner for Establishments, Training and Pensions, Mr. Benson Akintola, challenges public servants to come up with ideas that will ensure the quality of government's procurement activities. One of the strategies for improving government passive performance, including procurement decisions and activities, is by becoming better at collecting and analyzing relevant data. According to them, governments must decide what to measure and how, always with an eye on the overall goal of the program or initiative. I therefore challenge the Lagos State Public Service to come up, up with data backed and data inspired ideas that will ensure and assure the quality of the government's procurement activities. In a separate interview, facilitators explain areas of focus during the training. The Public Procurement Act has actually been uh, transformed into Lagos. We have the department in charge of PPA. As, outside that, we also need to increase the skill of the personnel that will handle this process because procurement is a very critical process and those who are to manage that process must be aware of what is required of them to be able to do that. No matter what, if you have confidence in what you are doing, then you'll be able to achieve more and that means you'll be able to deliver good corporate governance for the great people of Lagos. If you look at the procurement law as it stands today, uh, it's uh, basically only for federal government. It's only legal state that is having a procurement agency. And for that alone, and for you to be a very good procurement officer, you need to be competent. And competence, if you look at procurement, is not something that uh, you can get from school. It's something that you need to retrain yourself to look at what is obtainable internationally and procurement for you to be a very good competent uh, procurement officer you also have to have the skill and knowledge of data analysis and one of the things we've done so far is to talk about the challenges that we're facing and also look at our solutions to provide solutions on how to mitigate those challenges Participants are upbeat about the advantages the training will afford them. Training is a very good and timely training, and I believe that the challenges the facilitators have stated, by the time we finish this course, they would provide solutions that would help us to make the procurement process better. And by this I mean um, coming together, making sure there's no nepotism, making sure that um, every process that is involved is followed to the letter. If you are saying you are moving to... Uh, a smart city. That shows that what is obtainable in most of the advanced countries like uh, the Union of Soviet, Socialist Republic, United Kingdom of Great Britain and other islands, and the God's own country, United States of America. What is going on there? The government is trying to replicate them back home with minor socio-cultural specificity that will suit Lagos State. That is why the governor is saying Lagos State is trying to move from being a mega city to a small city. That's why you see this kind of training. Any of the Lagos State public uh, servant, if you ask them to go and do any function outside the country, I believe with this kind of training, they will perform creditably well. At another session, administrative officers are taken through the culture of strategic management and innovation. We expect you at the end of the program. These trainings are meant to position the state public service to be globally competitive. 